Hi, I'm Dr. Stephanie Sarkis, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about what it was like when I was diagnosed with ADHD. I was diagnosed when I was 23. I always knew that there was something kind of going on um, as far as my attention span, my ability to focus. I remember uh, my friends could study for three hours at a time in the, the library at college, and I just kind of would wander around the library. Um, I heard stories about my hyperactivity when I was a child. Uh, so I kind of had a pretty good idea something was up. So I went to a psychiatrist um, for an evaluation, was diagnosed with ADHD. I um, have been taking medication since. Um, the first thing that I remember feeling was relief, that I finally had that missing puzzle piece. I knew why I couldn't focus. I knew why my report card said doesn't work to potential. I knew why um, I had to read through something three times before I understood what it said. Um, so it really kind of put all that into place for me. The other feeling I went through was a feeling of, wow, what if I had gotten diagnosed earlier? Uh, college would have been easier for me. High school would have been easier for me. Elementary school would have been easier for me. So I went through kind of this, this phase where I, I felt um, sad or almost grieved over uh, what I could have been earlier in my life had I been diagnosed. Um, but after that phase, then I got into a phase of acceptance. And I realized that you, know, you get diagnosed and you get diagnosed. And there's a good reason why you get diagnosed at a certain time in your life. Um, in my case, um, because I was diagnosed at 23, I had all the years before 23 to uh, use an example to tell other people what ADHD was like. Um, and I also, uh, at the phase of acceptance, uh, realized that I could find other people with ADHD and talk with them about having it, um, reach out and have the ADHD community. Um, to talk to. Also, I could help other people at ADHD. So those are the phases I went through. I went through um, relief and then uh, grieving and a sense of loss and then acceptance. And sometimes you go through those phases all at once because when you have ADHD, you kind of like to get everything done at one time. Um, you can go through those phases back and forth. Um, I think another important part of the, the whole phase of being diagnosed is forgiving yourself and, and realizing that, you know, there were some things that are out of your control and it, it's okay now because now you know what's going on with your brain and now you can get help with it. Um, so, again, I, I think that, that it's really important to to remember that you get diagnosed when you get diagnosed and there's a reason why at that point in time that you were diagnosed um, and that going through those phases is normal and part of the whole ADHD diagnosis process.